eight flowers. Man, this video is for you. It's for us. Now, you are my brothers. Uh, this has nothing to do with black men only. It has to do with white men, Asian men, Latino men, black men, German men, uh, Arabic men. It uh, doesn't matter who you are as long as you are a man. And you can comprehend English. And it's about those of you, those of us, who value our legacies. Let's be honest with ourselves. There are men out here who have not established anything in their lives in terms of building something for the future for themselves and or their families. Especially a family if you have children, grandchildren and a wife, spouse, what have you built? And if you haven't built it already, what are you working on building? Mm -hmm. Ask yourself those questions. Are you the type of man that is so easily swayed by the opposite sex? Have you been allowing women to dictate your future for you instead of you being in control of your own future? Well, you need to stop it. Now, I can say this across the board. Our lives are our own, men and women, but you guys, I'm talking respectfully to you right now. Take charge of your life. I've said this many times. We are on this planet once. As a human being. I'll put it like that. So. You must make sure that you have all of your ducks in a row. You must make sure that you have a purpose. And that you are purpose driven. And if you are not. Shame on you. What age does this begin, men? When you are mature, here has no age limit. You can be mature at 16, 18, 20 years, and 30 years of age. But wherever you come to yourself and you say, well, I need to be thinking about tomorrow not necessarily talking about literally tomorrow but next year the next 5, 10, 15, 20, 30 years you need to be thinking about it in terms of what are you leaving behind on this planet what are you building on this planet how you are impacting someone's lives in a positive sense on this planet if you've been thinking about it be very careful of the women that you invite into your life. Make sure that they will be and are in support of what you're doing. No one has the right, and I'm talking about women specifically, men, no woman has the right to come into your life and get your eyes bugged, bugged out, your nostrils flared, and take your dream away from you and destroy what it is that you are about building for your future even if it can I should say even if it includes her sometimes they won't see that but I want to say to you your dream your goal your legacy is more important than a piece of behind just simply calling it what it is. Some guys, you see what you like. She smells good, looks good, built good. The way she speaks is alluring. Don't be deceived by that. The scripture 
says it many, many times over. Watch out for that woman. That woman will destroy you. That woman can destroy you. So ask yourself the question again, guys. How important is your legacy? Well, I'm going to answer it for you. It's not less important than the woman that you're dealing with. In other words, that woman should not be more important than your legacy. If she wants to be on board with you and help you get there to that place that you are striving to get to, and you can see this, then go for it. But ask yourself the operative question here. Why am I with this woman? I said it. Guys, one more time I'm going to repeat this to you. If you have a relationship with a woman. Either casually, romantically. If she's your legal wife why are you with that woman ask yourself the question why are you with her and if it's spiritually slash intellectually and that will help you get to your goal in life and she's going to be your partner in life unconditionally that's the woman to be with but anything else if it's all about cosmetics and aesthetics she looks beautiful drop dead gorgeous you want to have her on your arm you want to parade her around so people can think you have something special if that's what you want then be ready to lose everything that you are working for. That's really it. I'm not going to let this video run on and run on. I've just given you something to think about. But when you get past your thinking, make a decision. Now if you keep bumping your head after you've seen this video, after you heard my take, you keep bumping your head and you are dealing with that type of woman. You deserve it. You'll go back and you'll watch my video or you, you will think about it again. He said that. He did say that, didn't he? Wow, I should have listened. When you've crashed and you've burned, you're going to say, teacher said that to us. He warned me of that. Or you may even be that type of person or that individual that's watching me right now say, I've already been through that. I've been burned. I've lost everything. Dealing with the woman because she was fine, a diva. She was drop dead gorgeous. She was beautiful. She was a dream girl. And all of the other adjectives you'd like to use to describe her. But she was poisoning at the same time. Looks are deceiving, guys. Let me tell you. Women will get older. Oftentimes they will lose that beauty that you were attracted to in the early part of the relationship. What's left then? Hello. You're going to jump to another one and start it all over again. I hope not. Make sure you pick the right one the first time. That was all I had to say. Don't let a woman steal your dreams because they're your dreams. Don't let a woman destroy your legacy because it's yours. You have to decide if she's going to be on board for the ride. That was Brother Teacher. I'll see you next time. I know. And so on.